sa case 4 ng trigonometry transformation, sectan, sec, secant, tangent, cosecant, cotangent para yung ginagamit. Pero, iba yung condition niya. Kapag n is odd, use secant squared x minus 1 is equal to tangent squared x. Tsaka, cosecant squared x minus 1 is equal to cotangent, cotangent squared x. Para sa cosecant and cotangent. So, ito, tinirab lang yan sa 1 plus tangent squared. Nilipat lang yung 1 sa kabila. Yung katulad sa case 3. Pero sa case 4, n is odd. So, sa example number 1, hindi natin magagamit yung case 3 kasi second cube. Hindi mo malalabas, hindi ka makakagawa ng ano dyan na 1 plus tangent squared kasi may matitira pa ang second. So, da, ang gagawin dyan, maglalabas ka ng second at tangent. Tig isa sila. Second tangent. Tapos, magiging second squared 2x tangent squared 2x. Yx. Yan. Since nalabas natin sila, expand natin tong tangent. Gamit to. Second 2x tangent 2x second second 2x second squared x oops second squared 2x minus 1 dx so after my expand i-distribute natin tong tatlong to dito tsaka dito so giving second 2x tangent 2x second raised to 4 2x minus dx muna minus second 2x tangent 2x second squared 2x dx yan na sila so makikita natin may 2x pa dito sa loob gagawin muna natin dyan is mag ililet yung muna natin yan para mawala yung 2x na yan magiging u is equal to 2x derivative ng u is 2dx so balik tayo magiging 1 half second u tangent u second so for u du minus one half second u tangent u second squared u du after nyan mag sa substitute ulit tayo so v naman v is equal to second u Kaya di ba sa unang nilabas natin yung sec, itag isa, yung second, tsaka tangent. Kasi ang derivative na second is second u tsaka tangent u, du. Yan, mapapansin yung makakancel to, di ba? So, ito na siya. Okay, one half, second u tangent u, v raised to 4, dv over second u tangent u cancel to cancel cancel minus one half integral of second u tangent u v squared dv cancel cancel so, matitira na lang 1 half integral of v raised to 4 dv minus 1 half integral of v squared dv integral natin by fundamentals maybe. times 1 over 5 v raised to 5 uh, minus 1 half 1 third 
PQ plus C. So, magiging 1 over 10. Ano yung bin natin? Second. Second raised to 5. U minus 1 over 6. So, anong value ng U natin? Finally. Finally. 2x minus 1 over 6. 2x plus C. Ito ang final answer. Tento. Ayan. Example number 2. Integral of 1 over sin raised to 5x times tangent raised to 5x dx. Sa question na to, makita natin, pag pinaghiwalay itong ano, dalawang to, magiging 1 over sin. So, ano, ano bang value ng 1 over sin? Cosecant. Tapos ang 1 over tangent is cotangent. So, gagawin natin yun. So, gagawin natin silang cosecant raised to 5, 5x times cotangent raised to 5x dx. Ayan na, match na sila. Dito sa unang given. Ay sa ano, sa sa definition ng case number 4. Ayan. Kuha, lalabas na, maglalabas tayo ng tigisang cosecant tsaka cotangent. Magiging ganito na sila. Cosecant raised to 4 x and cotangent raised to 4 x second x cot x dx. Then, itong cotangent raised to 4 x convert natin gamit to ito, gawin natin cosecant squared giging cosecant is to 4x times cosecant per yan ba naging squared to kasi cotangent raised to 4 bali dalawang ano dalawang cotangent squared so expand natin yan nagiging cosecant raised to 4x Ayan, cosecant is to 4x minus 2 cosecant squared x plus 1 cosecant x cot x dx then next is distribute natin tong to sa dito sa bawat terms magiging Cosecant raised to 8x CSC Secot x dx Minus 2 Cosecant 2 cosecant raised to 6x CSC x cotangent x dx then lastly plus integral of CSE x cotangent dx so moving on mag substitute na tayo bale ang ito itsura nya let u is equal to cosecant x so, du is negative csc times eh, negative csc x times cotangent x dx. Then, input natin dito sa dito. Magiging magiging u raised to 8 integral u raised to 8 cosecant x cot x du over negative cse cot x makikita nyo mga cancel to matitira tong negative minus 2 integral na u raised to 6 cosecant x 
cotangent x du over negative c s c x cotangent x plus integral neto is cosecant kasi derivative ng cosecant is negative so magiging cosecant negative cosecant x plus c then i-simplify pa natin to uh, integral long u raised to 8 du is negative u raised u u raised to 9 over 9 negative kasi may negative pa dito ayan. plus kasi plus neg may negative pa dito so negative times negative positive plus 2 ra u raised to 7 over 7 minus cosecant x plus c and then yung value ng u natin is cosecant so magiging csc raised to 9 x over 9 plus 2 over 7 cosecant raised to 7 x minus cosecant x plus c ayan ang final answer sa tanong na to